Hi everybody, this is Roland Barbecue Smoker Pros, Brasselton, Georgia. We're gonna make some quick roasted corn for dinner tonight. We're gonna have some pulled pork, ribs, roasted corn, mac and cheese. And I mentioned yesterday about the rotisserie motor to make it portable if you wanna do events, catering jobs, that you don't need a generator. And everybody's like, well, then how do you plug it in? Well, I mentioned you could use your truck. Now, a lot of pickup trucks do have an outlet in the back. And I don't even have to run my motor. This is just running off the battery. We're only going to be cooking the corn for probably 12 to 15 minutes and I'll give you an update how things go but I don't see a problem so again if you're in the market to do backyard catering events fairs and you don't want to spend 12 15,000 for a big corn roaster we have these stainless steel ones with propane with firewood charcoal Yes, the motors are 50 watts. They have to be plugged in. You can use an extension cord. You can plug it into your truck. Yes, you can run a generator. Yes, you could probably plug it into your house if you wanted to. No problem. So we'll give you an update on how this is going in about another 15 minutes. Barbecue on. Corn roaster on. Hey, everybody. This is Roland again. I'm not really good with videos, so I'm trying to pause and show you the whole process. We're about four minutes in, five minutes in. We're at the 450 degree mark. I don't know if you can see through the glass. The corn, I'm gonna open this up real quick. The corn is starting to get that, it's really hot in here, that brownish burnt black look on it and so again as we open the door and close it we're now down to 400 we'll get back up to 450 and I'll come back in about another eight minutes or so hi everybody this is Roland again part three hopefully this is coming through we've been running a little bit hotter close to 475 500 and we're now at about 14 minutes in. Hot. And the corn is just busting out of its husk here. Let me turn the gas off. It's so hot. You can see the ends are blackish. Middles are brownish black. You see, we'll let this go around another one. We'll try to, we'll stop it there. We'll pull that one out for you to see. And that's it. So uh, 450. We're 14, 15 minutes in. Wow, look at this. Nice, plump, juicy corn on there. Let's get the other one over here. Over here, I don't I want my phone to melt. It's really hot. Juicy. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's really has a yellowish look here. We'll take this. One here, and that's, that's the corn roasting business. Right there now, we did two cooks yesterday. This is just for dinner tonight. I have not cleaned it. And that's all you need is a shop vac. Really, a wet paper towel will probably be this. So what I'm saying is, very simple cleanup. There, that's a really good. Can you see that, I hope, in the picture? Juicy and hot. 
And so that is the corn roasting business. Um, so we have these stainless steel ones that we can mail anywhere in the country. We have firewood charcoal ones. We have propane ones. And we have the big monster ones. So give us a call, holler, text 770-866-2561. And these ears cost us 40 cents. Yes, it was 10 ears um, for four bucks. And I got like almost 30 ears, I think, yesterday. We did about 22 or so, and there's another uh, eight or nine ears here for dinner. So it's just quick for dinner barbecue on and corn roaster on.